Now moving further afield, oil prices in Asia slipped today as concerns over global demand growth and increased supply weighing on the market. Brent crude futures fell 13 cents to $84.12 a barrel, while U.S. West Texas immediate crude futures rose 14 cents to $80.19 a barrel. Both benchmarks saw a 2% increase on Monday, reaching their highest level since April. To discuss these trends further, we turn to FNB portfolio manager Gabelo Tula. A very strong day on the local side. We saw markets rallying 3.7% on the back of uh, the formation of that government of national unity, led primarily by financials, uh, who, who, which showed extremely good uh, performance. Most of the banks, they're up over 6%. Uh, certainly, and uh, all the other sectors uh, up quite nicely. But uh, quite interesting throughout the day has been the performance of the oil price. Initially, uh, weaker by uh, a few cents below the 84 or so close to the $84 a barrel mark. Um, but as of now, at the time of writing, the, the price had recovered quite nicely to back above 85 And this Volatility is being driven by many factors, uh, but ultimately demand being the key driver and obviously being in a, a high interest rate environment and many uh, central bank officials speaking uh, internationally, we, we've we seen uh, announcements that have led the, the price to move higher to this level where it's sitting at 85. But also we we got some data out of China, which was showing that the refining capacity for the month of May had decreased by 1.8, signaling a slowdown uh, in that economy. So right now we're waiting to see how, how the, the oil price fares and um, the markets are watching in anticipation.